Let's talk about rose water. If you've watched my other videos about my skincare routine, you will know that rose water is an integral part of my skincare routine. I can't do without it. And oh God, I'm obsessed with it. But I buy this one. Promise I'm not affiliated with any of these brands. I try things and buy things online. I try to assess whether I think it's gonna be a good quality, then I buy it. If it's shit, I won't do a video about it. If it's good, then I will. Um, and I really like this one. Um, I can't oh, I need my glasses, but anyway, it's by this uh, brand. I'll put the link below. Um, you can buy it off Amazon. It's made in Europe. Um, it's actually Bulgarian rose water, and that's it. There's nothing else in it. It's the distillation. It's the byproduct of the distillation of rose otto, rose flowers, basically, that's used in uh, perfumery. So the oil is super, super expensive. Um, you might pay pro about seven to eight thousand uh, euros for one liter of pure rose oil, but rose water is actually a byproduct of that distillation process. So it's what's left over, and it's so amazing because it then has the amazing balancing uh, and calming properties that rose oil actually has, but in a very mild form and a much more affordable. Form. So I bought this, this is like half a litre and what I do is then I just get a bottle like this and I just, well, take the lid off and pour it. I'm not going to do it because I'll spill it all over the floor probably. But yeah, I use it in the morning after I cleanse and then I just go like this, you know. I, I find that for, for toning, I don't need to use the cotton wipe to keep wiping my face. I don't like to keep irritating my skin. I've just cleansed it with the flannel and my jojoba oil. If you watch my other video, you can see that. But yeah, and you can put it on. And then you can put it on after your makeup as well. But then you can use it throughout the day as well, which is so amazing. Oh my God, the sun is coming out shiny. The weather's been so shit lately here. Um, but and, and it's going to bring for the next like 15 days. So today I'm making the most of it and doing lots of videos because the sun shines through my studio here and it's amazing. So, um, and I look like an angel. <laughs> so rose water, after your makeup, it helps to set your makeup, but it helps to give you like that dewy effect on your skin, especially if you're wearing a lot of powder and stuff like that, but then use it when you're traveling, if you're on the plane, if you're allowed to go on a plane anymore, who knows. Um, but yeah, so use the rose water. It won't give you any spots. It's got nothing in it. It's just rose water, that's all. And it's like literally distilled water and it smells like rose and it's amazing. Look at the ingredients when you're looking for rose water as well though. And it should just say like rose hydrosol, um, you know, that's it. Um, flower distillate uh, ingredients, rosa damascena. The rosa damascena is the one that they use in perfumery and in aromatherapy. And um, it's a very expensive oil, mostly comes from Bulgaria or Turkey. This one is from Bulgaria. Uh, so it's an excellent quality oil, but make sure it's not got anything else added to it. If you fancy a little bit more fragrance, then perhaps add a couple of drops of geranium oil, which will actually help to balance uh, the oil production of your skin. So it's actually nice and it's got a really nice aroma, but you probably just need maybe about, I don't know, five drops or something in this, no more. Uh, but because oil and water don't mix, you'll need to shake it every time. But yeah, just rose water is enough. It's amazing. It's got amazing healing properties as well for your skin. And yes, it actually has anti-aging properties. What's anti-aging? I don't know. We're all aging, aren't we? You know, well, I don't know. I'm getting younger, but I'm going to be 21 again next week. But I think that it really makes a massive difference with my skin. There's two things you need to know about rose water before I go. There's a type that you can buy in the supermarket. It's food grade and you can actually drink it and that's fine. And some people might drink this one as well. But the one in the supermarket is often food grade and it means it's been really refined, which means a lot of the properties have actually been removed. The properties that are actually beneficial for your beautiful glowing skin because it really will make a difference. In fact, I'll give you a challenge. Go and buy some food grade rose water from the supermarket that is really cheap. Maybe I used to buy it in Dubai for I think 10 dirhams, so a couple of euros. Um, and then buy this one that's obviously more expensive, but oh my God, the difference that you will see in your skin using an organic one. So um, yeah, I really recommend rose water. For beautiful radiant glow like mine. Ah, why not? See you soon for more fascinating facts.